Have you noticed there's a gas fire in the panda exhibit? It's there to draw your attention to the very important issue of energy technology, which is being developed to provide a glimmer of hope for the giant panda and other endangered species around the world. The panda habitat is surrounded by millions of people and they all have energy needs. Traditionally, these needs have been met by harvesting timber from the panda habitat areas. If we can supply the people in this region with an alternative energy source, we'll be taking a great leap forward towards slowing down deforestation and giving all the animals in this region a brighter future. One of these technologies is biogas. To create biogas, we capture animal and human waste as well as vegetable matter and store it in tanks underground where it can ferment and produce methane gas. So local families can heat and cook using biogas, saving many tons of firewood every year. If you wanted to make a significant difference to the plight of the panda, you can even purchase a biogas stove for a family in China and help them make a positive impact instantly. Visit giantpanda.org.au and discover new ways to continue your journey on the way of the panda. But this is only the beginning. The University of Adelaide Environment Institute is working on long-term energy technology solutions. It can not only help the giant pandas, but climate change and endangered species around the world. G'day. I'm Gus Nathan from the Centre for Energy Technology, which I lead, and uh, the centre is developing technologies to help mitigate climate change. Climate change is arguably the greatest, or certainly one of the greatest threats to habitat on which pandas and all other species depend, including humans of course.